We know how important a table of contents is for a long-length article. If the article is more than 2,000 words, that time a table of contents plays a very important role. It creates jump links in the article that's why visitors easily can understand what the article is addressed about, and it helps to find their information without any hassle. In this video, I'll show you how to add a table of contents manually without any plugin. This method is very simple and easy. Let's jump on it. First, go to admin dashboard then all posts. Open the post where you want to add a table of contents. In this post, I'll show you how to add a table of contents manually. First, we have to create an HTML anchor in every heading. For this, click on the heading. And you'll see a post and block option in the right hand corner. Click on block. When you click on the advanced option, the HTML anchored box will appear. Copy the headline and paste it into the box. If you want, you can remove the hyphen and use underscore. But remember one thing, don't use dot or any space in the heading. Every HTML anchor text has to be unique. To remember, just copy every heading and paste it. This would be very easy for you also. Use this same process on every heading. I have done all the process. Now we have to create a heading on table of contents. where we will add. A table of contents usually appears near the top of a post. You can add it anywhere in your article if that's what you want. It's totally up to you. Type table of contents. Now your left hand corner you can see the plus icon. Click on it. After that click on the list. Now one by one copied all the headings and paste them into the list block section. Notice one thing here. This is H2 and this is H3 which means subheading. For adding a subheading copy the heading and press enter under the heading that you want to include in the subheading. Now click on the indent list item space and add all subheading. All we have done. Now it's turn to add jump links. To add jump links, we have to add here HTML anchor that we have added a few minutes ago. To get the HTML anchor text click on the heading and copy it from the advanced HTML anchor tags. After that select the first line of the table of contents text. Now click on the link icon. And type hash then put it into the link icon. Press internal to save the link. Use this same process to add jump links. After you're done, hit the update button. Click the preview option on the live site to view your table of contents. As you can see, the table of contents has been manually added.
Through this video, I try to show you how to add a table of contents manually in a simple way. But my suggestion will be to go with the plugin, because if you don't use the plugin you have to add a table of contents for each post separately. Or if you use a plugin it will save your time and you don't have to add a table of plugins separately for each post. There is a separate video on our channel on how to create a table of contents with plugin. You can watch that video by clicking on the i button. Also included a link to the video in the description. Check it out. That's all for today. Make sure to like and subscribe now if you enjoyed the video.